Hello everybody, and today I've got another diecast review for you, and this is on two new uh, 2019 164 scale diecasts, so I'll jump right into it here. First we've got Daniel Hemmerich's number 8 Liberty National Life Insurance Chevy Camaro. Uh, very nice looking car. Um, it kind of reminds me of like the Se Seattle Seahawks colors because they've got the darker blue with the lime green kind of mixed in. really do like how they just kind of mixed in here on this, this paint scheme. It's got a nice balance, nice overall looking paint scheme. A uh, pretty good Liberty National paint scheme compared to some of the other ones. Ryan Newman's last year wasn't too bad, but uh, kind of like this one a little better. Uh, way better than the Trevor Bean paint scheme. But yeah, again, we'll take a look at the front, Liberty National. And there. Again, that just kind of a nice, nice little bit of green, but not too much of it in there. Really do look kind of like that shade of green there. Just overall, a very nice looking uh, paint scheme. Diecast. One thing I will note about this uh, diecast here is it's got kind of a more of a mate finish. It doesn't have a super glossy finish to it. I don't know if you can really tell just by looking at it, but the, when you feel it, it is fairly glossy. Not, not super glossy though, compared to how smooth of a finish it is on the other diecast. So that's that, and then we have Clint Boyer's number 14 Rush Truck Centers Ford Mustang. And this is real nice, another Mustang to have. Really do kind of like this paint scheme, especially compared to some of the old Rush Truck Center paint schemes that Tony Stewart had. It's just kind of gave it new life. Just feel like it's just a real nice brand of this kind of the golden yellow, the red. And I really do like kind of the black rather than having the white as part of the paint scheme. Really nice, really nice new looking Ford Mustang body there. The big spoiler, splitter as well. Just, just very nice looking overall. Yeah, Ford GT Mustang. On the back, just very nice overall. Really like this paint scheme. I do have uh, the 2018 version as well. It looks real nice on the, the Mustang here as well. So yeah. Well, that's that. And that is all for this rev review. Uh, stay tuned for more diecast reviews, more stop motions. Uh, my new series, The Next Lap, is out. Kind of a little bit of a NASCAR updates, weekly updates type thing. Real uh, short videos right now. We'll see how they turn out. And so that's pretty much all from me. And this is Corey Klatt, signing off.